This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this 28th day of March. This is Tuesday. Looking at the Dow 37 at 10 o'clock this morning, 32,469. Dow's a little stronger than the other indices at this particular moment because you can see the S&P right now is down about 10 at uh, 39.66. Got repelled from yesterday's high. Right in the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone, looking at the QQQ and the X100 pulling back. Now, there's a chance that if we go under 302.50, that this little top that was made three, four days ago is going to stay a little longer. But if by the end of the day there's a reversal and the S&P is able to go, um, I'd say, four to five points higher, That'll be a good sign to say we're trying to find some support. And you can see the QQQ, which actually today I want to, oh, that was the QQQ. I should have shown the S&P. S&P right there. There's the S&P repelled at that uh, resistance area, the QQQ index 100, pulling back. And as I said, under 302.50, that's not good. If by the end of the day, and it's really important, today is very important, we come back to the high of 308.20, preferably close above that. I tell you that that's much better action. IWM, Russell 2000, <clears throat> still very weak, even though it's up six uh, cents at 173.74. Here's the big issue. Gold. Gold is up 10 at 1964. It's still holding after that peak D and the H pattern that it's forming. If at any point in the next two days it breaks under 1937, that's going to be very poor. Right now it's at 1964. But this is telling us that the financial situation is still in play. So we've got to be a little careful about that. Looking at the bonds, U.S. bonds right now, uh, down uh, 6.30 seconds at 1.30 and 5.30 seconds. Also got that H pattern. Looks very much like gold, actually. <clears throat> Going to crude oil. We want to see the crude oil, what it's doing here. Holding steady at uh, 72. Let's call it 73, up to 20 cents. Um, not bad action, but still within the range of the lower end. I'll be back in a few moments for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. A lot to discuss coming up, and I'll get to it, plus a lot of stocks that we want to look at. Be back in a moment.